Good morning, everybody. It's the day after the crazy wind storms. Anthony's house, his fence blew down, so we're gonna help him real quick. We got the truck hooked up, we got our new trailer, in case we have to mi mix some cement to put these posts in, which probably wouldn't be a horrible idea. Oh yeah, that shouldn't be too bad. It looks like they just snapped. Go in, hopefully he's awake, and we will see what's going on. That's Dylan. Hi, Anthony. Come over here to fix your stuff and you're sleeping. Oh, you must not know. I have a super successful YouTube channel. Taking off these panels, we're just going to disconnect the different sections. One, two, three. We can pull these out of the way. We'll set new posts. We can probably just screw all this stuff back up and it should be good to go. My man's out here in slippers with no socks, a tank top. It's like 40 degrees. He should have been up. I thought you said that one was good, Danders. We got the holes dug over here. Just post now. We'll grab some breakfast. We'll set these in here. Oh, time to get some posts. Those ones? You got a post know. about me getting posts? Maybe. These are treated right here. Treated right here, right here. Well, that's, what, that's what I just said. Are they treated right? He's still in his slippers, everybody. We dug all the holes and everything, and he's still in his slippers. Was it? Yeah. We got ourselves some Jersey Mike's. Thanks to Anthony. Shout out to the people, Anthony. He's camera shy. Walking out, got done with lunch. Then I had to refill his cup. Heading back to Anthony's. Getting the post in now. That one's sitting a little bit high, but we're not going to talk about that. Mix a, mix a little bit wet, but we'll thicken her up. Anthony's grabbing some more stuff. You can kind of see the eclipse going on right now. This is through a welding head. You can kind of see the moon crescenting the sun right now. Sorry, it's kind of hard to get stable and shoot through this welding hood, but that's what I'm checking out right now. Back at Anthony's, we dropped the truck and trailer off at my house to get ready for some curbing. These are good and set up. Set up these panels and get with it. All right, so the posts are good. Got the rest of the fence put up. This slat broke, but he'll just need to buy a new one. That's why there's a like gap there. Other than that, we're all set. We're gonna go, hopefully, grab some water reducer and then start laying some curb at my place. Oh, we are back at the house, finally. We need to put a ring around this tree. Danny's gonna prep the area. Prep the area and then Get the mixer fired up and start mixing some mix, and then we'll try out the new machine. Hopefully it all goes well. So we use the sod cutter, got our circle cut out, kind of got messed up right in here. We'll we'll fix that when we actually lay the curb, it'll go straight. Now I think we have to mix some and then start feeding it. First curb with the new machine. It gets troweled out, so I mean it'll look better. You can see right there, he's going over it. And it smooths everything out real nicely. But yeah, with the new machine first run, that's pretty good. Usually it takes some learning to kind of get used to. I feel like the mix is a bit, bit wet. Just, that's what I was thinking. It didn't feed quite as well, so I thought maybe just a hair bit wet. But yeah, that turned out, it looks like it lays it pretty nice, compacts it somewhat well. Now we put like a coloring on it and you roll out like a stamp on it, and then we'll blow this off and put sealer. It should be pretty good. Other mix, Okay. Almost done, but one of our sprayers messed up, so we have to run to Home Depot right quick and grab a sprayer so we can um, seal that concrete and the release and stuff like that. Yeah, this first job of the year, working out some other little paints, trying to get everything together. Those, those chemicals just eat through those sprayers, so it's kind of hard to keep one nice for a reasonable amount of time. Bought the cheap ones. That's probably why they get messed up, but it'll work for today. Got the sprayer. This is kind of the final product. Looks all glossy. The sprayer didn't work too well, but it'll be enough to cover it and seal it for now. Yeah, this is there around the tree. Once everything dries, we'll clean up like all this, the slag and stuff, but what do you think, Dan? I think it's good. Yeah, me too. I think it looks good. Got everything cleaned up now, pretty much. I still got some sprinkler work to do. Danny and Will did it. Ah.
Uh, look at how proud he is. Super good. The wind was kind of blowing, so a few things kind of got in there, but for the most part, it looks super good. What's up, guys? We got everything cleaned up. We just ate some dinner. We're going to go out for some ice cream right now. I got a new hoodie. I don't know what color it looks on the camera. It looks kind of just like cream or gray on the camera. It's, I don't know. It's almost like a purple or I don't know. It's kind of a weird coat, but I like it. So, yeah, let's go get some ice cream. Oh, we're going to Cold Stone. Cold Stone's such a good ice cream place here in Cheyenne. We all got our ice cream, banana nut crunch, some Lucky Charms, and then like some cake batter stuff. It's not too bad, but ice cream's like super sweet, so it's hard to eat a lot of. What's going on, everybody? We just got back from ice cream. It's getting a little bit late, so I think I'm going to call it a night, and we will see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everybody. How's it going? So right now I'm out and about going to reset the trap the trap sprung in the high wind we have i think and rebate it just kind of make everything fresh again then i'm off to work i think we're starting a new install today so that should be fun hopefully that will take us just a couple days and then i don't know what's going to go on so um i will see you there I just got out here to the trap. You can see it's been triggered. I don't know if it was from the wind or not. Oh, let me see. The holes don't look like they've really been used. I'm not seeing any new markings around them, which who knows, you know, it's been super windy, so stuff might've gotten blown, but either the wind set off the trap or some, and all the food or the bait's gone, which old mouse, cause they could fit in and out of one of these. But I'm going to rebate this and um, set up my camera again, put the new memory card in. I'm going to head to work. And we have arrived at work. So I'm going to go get the work truck set up. Just got to the rental place, filled out some paperwork and all that stuff. And we're grabbing a trencher right now. Kind of weird we don't actually own a trencher, but they're kind of a pain. And just the upkeep, it seems better if someone else does it. So we're gonna pick up a trencher and be on our way. <clears throat> so we got the trencher taken back. Sorry, I didn't show much of that. We have to get that back pretty quick. It's just cheaper on us, but we got everything trenched here in the backyard. Front yard smaller, but we got everything trenched. And we just need to like kind of dig to the heads and clear out the trenches since there's some stuff kind of, you know, I mean, dirt gets pushed back into it when you drive over and stuff like that. So yeah, we're going to work on clearing out all these trenches and we can finally put pipe in it. So, so we got all the heads in the front here done. It's kind of getting later in the day, so what I'm going to try to do is finish. Uh, well, he complains about me YouTubing, but yeah, we're going to try to complete the front. You guys always complain about what I do. Look at this mess. Cat boxing. <laughs> what's going on, every? What's going on, everybody? Uh, I'm at home now. I'm cooking some steaks. Um, yeah, we just did a little bit of backfill and got some stuff done there. It wasn't too exciting. I'll show you guys that in the morning when we test it out and stuff. It'll be something more to watch. But yeah, it's this evening. I'm cooking some steak. Pretty good grill flare up going. Hopefully be okay. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna cook these, eat, and then, I don't know, we'll see what happens. Good morning, everybody. I'm out here checking the trap, and look who's out here. A couple antelope. Oh, that's a good thing to see first in the morning. See some wildlife first things off? That's pretty neat. Let's see if we can... That's pretty cool. Nice. Good morning. I uh, just got to the work truck. Um, we're heading to the job. I'll show you what we did yesterday and then we'll get started on the backyard and hopefully get all that filled in and done pretty quick and hopefully the customer stays happy. <laughs> Woo! We got most of this back filled now. Got to pick up a couple piles of dirt, load that in the truck, but this is all looking pretty good. Kind of stormed on us a little bit, but hopefully it holds out long enough, long enough for us to get this done. It is 
all set to go. We just need to wait so the customer can test the system. Make sure they're happy with it. And then we should be good to get out of here. But yeah, we like to test it with the any complaints. We can just fix everything while they're here. But yeah, it turned out pretty good. There's definitely some spotty grass. It kind of got torn up here and there, but it comes back so quick. It's usually not too much to worry about. But yeah, we're all, I'm hopefully, cause I got soaked from testing sprinklers, but hopefully I'm gonna go home, get some food, get warmed up. It's getting cold here now. So hopefully I can get out of here pretty quick. Oh, it's cold. We just got off, got back to the, got back to work, switched out the work truck for the car. I'm letting the car warm up and I'm heading home. Hopefully we're gonna make some dinner and warm up because I don't know, I got wet from tuning sprinklers. And now I'm just freezing, so. Yeah, I'm gonna head home. Hey Dixie! We're out here at Danny's place. <laughs> oh yeah. We're out here at Danny's place. We're having to get his truck so we can go grab one of the trailers. You scratched my car because I have my dogs in there and Dixie's just super excited. Oh baby. Hi sweet. Hey! <laughs> About back home, I'm gonna drop the dogs off real quick because I just don't want them having to chill in the car while we dump everything out and other stuff like that. So drop them off wait for brooke i think she's gonna tag along we're gonna go get our trailer cleaned out and ready to go for tomorrow so first things first we got to get rid of all this sand this sand's really too coarse for what we like we need a lot finer sand for the curb so we got to shovel all this out and then yeah then get some new sand tomorrow so this is gonna be fun So that's about the end of the day. We came home after getting the trailer cleaned out. We loaded some shovels and stuff like that on it. Um, then we just ate some dinner and I think it's time to probably turn in for the night. This will probably be the end of this video because tomorrow we're starting uh, uh, the first curb of the year for a customer. So I'll probably just start that video tomorrow and we'll go from there. But anyways, I'd like to thank everyone for stopping in. I'm saying hi, like, comment, and subscribe if you don't mind. And we will talk to you next time.